Yo, what's good guys? This is Nightwing2303 from weartesters.com and today we finally get to take a detailed look at a special shoe that I've been just kind of like holding on to and waiting for for a long time. Most of you guys have already seen them. They are back here and this, this my friends, this is the upcoming Bram Black Times Wear Testers Rare Metal. <laughs> I've been wanting to show these guys off for a very long time. I did put them back there on purpose just to kind of like show because like, you know, that just looks sick, man. And I'm I'm so proud of, you know, building wear testers and, uh, you know, for what it was and to what it is now, including the YouTube channel. I just think it's awesome. It's something for, for me, at least, that I'm personally just proud of that. A lot of work has gone into it for myself as well as my other team members. And this right here, this is just a culmination of all of that hard work. And I just think that it's awesome. This is our second collaboration with a brand, uh, second with Brand Black in particular. Now, most of you guys know we did our first collab on Brand Black's Ether model, and that had a more traditional look to it, and the colors that I used were actually inspired just in, in part by the website weartesters.com. Our colors are real plain, they're just simple, black and white, old school, kind of 90s, uh, throwback to the old school days when players would just wear black or white sneakers. And I was able to design that shoe, the colors, the materials, all of that stuff on it, and I just, I just think that it came out really, really nice. However, a lot of people had complained, as most people do. It wasn't a big complaint, it was more of a like, hey, we wish that we saw a little bit more of me in there, which is more Nightwing per se. And so these guys right here, this is all Nightwing, baby, like these, this is it. This is the only brand black shoe that you will not see their traditional blue bottoms on. They are blue, but it is a different color blue. This is Nightwing blue, it's not brand black blue. The difference is everything. Now these guys do have a jacquard knit upper, but it is a very special pattern. It's really unique and I absolutely love it. It's got all of the colors in there thrown in together. You got black, white, blue. It looks awesome. I love this little stripe right here, man. This little stripe, it, it for me on a shoe, it just looks awesome. The PG-1 has it, these guys have it, the Jordan Team 1s have it, the Jordan 12s have it. I mean, there's so many shoes that have this little detail on there and for whatever reason, every time I like look down and I see that, I'm just like, dude, that's such a cool little design feature and I'm so glad that it's on the rare metal and I was able to highlight that by using that blue color. I wanted the midsole itself to be very special so I wanted the gradient look to it. I just think that it looks really slick going from blue to black. Really really clean and then on the medial side here it just looks real clean with that little stripe there and gets a little bit extra pop and I just dig it man. All of the logos and branding are also blue with the exception of the wear testers heel logo that is in white because that's our, our logo color like if you were just to look at that that's what it were all about right there. The original sample, which I do have, is actually downstairs, but those ones have the logo in blue. And that one, I was like, hey, I don't really like that. And they changed it back to white. The insole on these guys is super comfortable. And on this particular pair, it's very special. That is where it highlights the Brand Black and Wear Testers collaboration. These guys also have secondary laces as well. I actually prefer just the straight up black on black ones, but they have these like interesting ones that, that match that upper a little bit more. So if you wanted your shoes to pop a little bit, then, you know, swap out the laces for that and they're going to actually come with the shoe. When the shoe is going to release, that's up in the air right now. I personally do not know an exact release date, but I do know that they're going to be around that April or May time frame. If I were to guess, I would guess more towards the May side. I personally feel that these guys fit true to size. Some people will think that they fit a little bit big, but whatever you go with with your normal brand black size, I guess that's what I would go with. For me, my normal size works out perfectly. I'm just really like, yo, I can't believe that I got a design of a sneaker and they're going to release again like that crazy and i just love how they turned out man these things are super dope they're real sexy love the, the the look of the shoe in general and my colorway is just my favorite i just think that these are so dope it's got that nightwing flavor 
and uh, yeah man these are these are killer the box for these guys I don't think I could show right now but the box is sick too I believe they're gonna come with a dust bag and then these guys also are gonna feature for free they're just gonna come with the shoe uh, brand blacks socks I've been wear testing those and they're very comfortable they're they're tall socks for those of you that don't like my my no-shows which I do prefer but they are taller like normal size crew is that what it is crew socks or whatever but they're above the ankle and all that stuff so they're gonna match the shoe perfectly and for those of you guys that like rocking socks and everything like that then that's gonna come with the sneaker as well I believe the retail price is still gonna be 110 so to me that's really reasonable and I just really like these man as you can tell uh, you know I just I just love these not I'm not talking about performance I'm talking about overall just the aesthetic I just really like the way that this this came out it looks sick I've, I sent in this really like drawing at first but as you can see it looked exactly like the shoe actually came out and then they sent me back this rendering here and I was like man those look so sick and that's when the owner David was talking about the the knit pattern he was like how do you like it and all that stuff and like I was like dude that that is awesome and then when I got these in hand just crazy I will update everybody on weartesters.com and my Instagram and Twitter and all that stuff when these are releasing so if anybody is interested just stay tuned we'll we'll unveil everything soon enough but I was finally given the go-ahead to be like yo you can pump out a video and stuff so here's the video the, the detailed look get hyped up if you enjoy the collaborations and stuff like that because these are these are awesome. These are 100% me and I just, I absolutely love it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for all your support. Feel free to let me know what you guys think about them. If you think they're hot, if you think they're not, go ahead, comment below. I know that the internet is ruthless because y'all, y'all are completely anonymous and that's how bitches work. Just kidding. I'm just around, dude. I'm just super stoked. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate everybody's support over the years. Been doing this for a really long time, uh, since 2009. It's been forever. And uh, yeah, I just really, I really am, am super appreciative, so thank you guys so much, and until next time guys, have a good one.